the reason why the traps of 3D are as follows. One is fear, very simply enough. False evidence appearing real. If you can keep a population in fear, you keep them like sheep. It's not, it's, it's not brain science, it's not rocket science, it's actually very simple. Keep a population in fear, you keep their heads in the dirt looking at their feet. Okay, too scared to look up. Control, number one. Control number two, judgment. The problem is when you judge others is that you reflect, you know, you project your actually truly your weaknesses on another. And then they feel that and project their weaknesses or insecurities back upon you. It's a negative to negative situation. So to not do that is key because it's a trap. I can, I can only tell you uh, from my own experience, it is one of the easiest energetic traps in this place. If this place was created as a energetic rehab for dimensional beings who are really powerful, how would you take a really powerful being, take all their abilities away, limit them to this thing, your suit, right? So that they can learn their lessons. Because we resist learning these lessons. It's not easy to learn these lessons, okay? But that is how you do it. How do you take a gnarly creator being who has to learn a lesson that is uncontrollable, let's just say, or doesn't like to play well with others, let's just say, from a different star system that might be trying to try a new flavor, one, or two, just as I am projecting to you, right? But an entire consciousness that has seen so much of this stuff, how do you guide them back? Well, you need strong leaders that understand the experiences that they've had and can measure their own heart and integrity with trying to help their brothers and sisters, period, without any other motivation. These are the types of beings that are needed here on Earth. These are the types of harmonious alliances that need to be made. And a lot of the stuff that's taking place here on Earth is a, is a refraction, reflection um, of some of these conflicts, which are now over, okay, in the present moment. Same thing and trap, which you will go through when you wake up is, well, first one's fear, second one's judgment. When you go through judgment, then you're gonna have to do the reflection test, the reflection test of every single being that comes in contact with you. Once you go through the reflection test and you can hold and maintain your vibration, no matter where you're sent or wherever you are, that people's unconscious bounces off of you and it does not affect your field, once you are that strong, okay, then you will uh, begin to see and have access to some of the higher dimensions and realize and understand why you can't take that fear and you can't take that judgment upstairs. That's why it is left down here. All right. Hope that helps in some of my own reflection with you guys. And uh, to understand we're all in this together and the faster we reflect off each other, the faster this collective goes. Namaste.